Hello everyone, welcome back to Fableheim and War Tales. The marvelous mercenaries resume their journey in the Ludern region, a land that I know very little about. And today we're going to start off with an exciting endeavor to prove that we are worthy of this region and its challenges. We are going in to the arena. Now, we're going to start things off with just the normal arena, but I have noticed that the OG ladies, Barbarian Queen Rhaegor and Stabby Stabapathia, have reached level 8, and level 8 is the next threshold for armor. Well, blacksmithing armor. So, it won't show me here. We'll be heading back to a city with a blacksmith very soon. Actually, I actually have to go back to Marheim to get stuff out of my vault. So we'll be heading back to Marheim before we challenge the hard arena, but I thought that we would well, well, challenge ourselves. It's not every day that we see fighters like you. <laughs> You're not from around here, are you? Don't worry. Our new champion never turns down a challenge. How many times can I say challenge in the first few minutes? I thought I would challenge ourselves and go into this arena. Maybe underleveled? I don't know why, but my gut wants to say this arena is level 8. Zero context for that. This is what I'm feeling. I hate it when that happens. So, since we do think this will be challenging, we're going to go in with a very melee-focused composition. El Capitan is going to chill. We're bringing in Magnus, Rekord, Apathia, and of course, Red Sonia. This very hefty team. Uh, should be good to go, I think. Enemy animals apply vulnerability. Okay. Let's get to work. All enemies must take damage. Well, that's easy. That can... Oh. Does that include the wolves? Because I don't think that's going to happen. Well, the good news... Wow. Is that if the wolves are not included, we'll get some uh, AP. If the wolves are included, we'll still be okay. How do I want to do this? I could go... To, do I want a tactical order? Not really. What I'll do is I'll stand in front of Apathia, just in case. It is a wolf. What is this? Oh! They're... They're leashed. Interesting. Now, Apathia... Excuse me. Red Sonia... Cannot disengage... Meaning, excuse me, oh right, it was deflection, I was like, what is this damage, or lack thereof, uh, meaning if I would like to do anything about this, I'm going to have to go stop her, alrighty. Now, for Red Sonia, I am a little worried about this person, this fair individual. So, we'll ease my worries by demolishing them. I'm not sure where this individual is going to go, but um, I can't reach him anyway. Emperor Magnus. I think you're just going to go, uh, smackaroo. We can even start with a taunt. Magnus's damage is not something I would call incredible, so... That'll do. Okay. Let's see, shall... Do the wolves count? Wow, you are just going in. 
They did not. Okay. Or they did. Now, unfortunately, Apathia. Or fortunately. Apathia has the pleasure of assisting our Emperor. I don't believe, though, that she can... Well, okay. Fair enough. You can go over here. Alright, Raycor. Oh, it, yeah, it changed. I was a little concerned I wouldn't be able to do an AoE attack, but I don't need to. Ooh, one, five, eight. There is another issue that I discovered. Uh, that'll make more inch more information later. More sense later. Then it's a critical hit they play bleed. These aren't great, but we'll take savagery. Every time an enemy unit deals a critical hit, an enemy animal launches an attack of opportunity if possible. Okay, fair enough. So, the Bog Thunder is a brand new legendary item we have acquired. It doesn't seem particularly great, um, but it does deal a heinous amount of damage against mosquitoes, and I think there are like just mosquito mobs that we'll have to face. I was going to allow Diana to be the one to wield this, but it requires level 8. And Diana is level 6. So I'm afraid Dia Raycor is going to have to deal with this if we want to use this as well. But uh, that's a thing for us to address when we fight mosquitoes. Each companion must end their turn next to an ally. Okay. Please work. Cool. My positioning there could have been a little sketch, but we're good. Because, of course, Raycor's insane movement comes from her inspiration. Which comes from breaking somebody's armor. So. And thankfully, it looks like this wolf is going to attack Magnus, our Emperor, who wasn't doing much to begin with, so. This will be fine. As for Red Sonia. I definitely would like to just repeat this, more or less. Oh. I was kind of hoping. Oh. Okay. I was hoping that I could kill him again, and with just the basic attack and then the multi attack. And then tie up uh, Chigurins with the Shield Bash. Being able to consume that poison is so good. Think we'll be fine if I do this? I'm ending my turn next to an enemy. Of course, I have not met the requirements, but we're not in hard mode, so I don't really have to. It does make me wonder, though. If we do this on hard mode, should I bring in Maleficar? Thank you for the free point. Oh, I'm capped though, aren't I? Mm. Ow. Alright, this is all you, Apatia. I wasn't kidding, Apatia. Aw, oh, poor wolf. He's contained. Chained. Well, that was dumb. But, he still got it. I need to be mindful of that positioning. So I don't accidentally cleave people. Every time a companion lends a crit, they gain rage. Every time a companion uses one or more valor points, they gain protection. Ooh, yeah, sure. Something, something defends this king. Every time an enemy unit is incapacitated, the, en the enemy animal with the most health can replay this round. Okay. 
Heal your health. Restore your armor. Valor, valor. Onward. Let me guess. The new champion is like a, a beast master or something. Although, to be fair... Ooh. Okay, so if the turn orders work the way they have every single turn... Uh, I'm going to fail this requirement. You'll notice, however, that I'm not particularly bothered. Well, these are all veterans, I think. Additionally, Raycor... We're going to have to go upgrade a weapon. We'll do that in Marhem. We're going to have to make quite the... The run. This is the run we've made before. Not that big of a deal. Please don't go next. Fantastic. We still have the concern about this. Do I? I don't really care about this, but I'm gonna pretend that I do. Like I don't really care, but I'm gonna pretend that I do. I actually remember to use this. Enhanced position increases my crit chance, but it looks like it didn't increase my crit chance enough. 20%? 20%! It wasn't enough. Uh-oh. Wow. Poor Red Sonia. Mega poor Red Sonia. Holy sh... This is fine. Apathia. Come here. Gonna heal. We're gonna start hitting. I have to make sure I re-equip a new torch. Okay. These should all be wolves. Because the two bottom ones are gonna regale. More than once, I guess. Okay. Not attack the same unit twice. Well, sorry, game. Or not. Was that in wait? Did I just get infectious oil, bro? I think I did. Okay. Wow. Dexterity? Galvanize. Galvanize. Okay, we need to restore armor to Red Sonia. And I suppose you can restore armor. All one of it. It is time to face the champion. Each companion must end their turn next to an ally. Okay. Doable. What we're going to do is we are going to protect. What do you do? Opportunity, chase. As long as the player's units are more than four meters away from their allies, I think I want to grab this guy, right? Tie him up. If I even can. Okay. Now here's the question. Do you think Do I think what? I should kill the wolves. Because I highly suspect they're about to become unchained. I don't know why I suspect that, but I do. I don't know if I can actually... Maybe I can? There's no way I can... 
I'd have to go like here and charge there, and then I'd have very little time for positioning. I think they're fine. Red Sonia and Apatia are strong, independent ladies who don't need no man. You know? Unfortunately, my requirement has not been met because they've been tied up. But the good news... The damage has been dealt. Is that the only good news? I think it is. We're about to see how tanky Magnus can really truly be. I do think it was the current call. Ooh, he's being poisoned though. That's really good. I mean... <clears throat> Totally why I tied him up. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to use my shield here. My shield bash. Get rid of the deflection. Then I'm going to hit the crap out of him. Fantastic. I'm going to go over here. And I'm going to go over here. And swing. Yep. Now remember. Okay. Fair enough. I'm going to go ahead and not do that. Oh dear. I'm going to go ahead and just... Ow! Mistakes are made. Mistakes... were made. Because great, I've disengaged. Now what? I can kill this wolf. As it fucking deserves. Or can I? I can. I really hope this is not him goofing again. Because Apati will be in her last leg if it is. Unless... Now, okay. Magnus is being bullied. A new round has begun. We need to refresh our buffs. Uh, I'm gonna smack him, and I'm gonna deflect. Yes, get poisoned. Now, ladies don't have uh, now is what we're gonna do. We're gonna swing here, like so. Then I'm gonna move down here. Like so. Like maybe over here. Just hide this bastard up. Okay. Also, by the way, if you die in the arena, I believe you don't die, die. So. There is yet hope. You know, there are consequences, but it's not like we're going to get absolutely screwed over. Seven health. Wrath. Ooh, okay. Probably should have read all the fine print. That would have been a good idea. Perhaps even grand idea. Unless Apatia can just bring it home. 
Shake in. My assassin. Your trip to London Ooh. certainly wasn't wasted mercenaries. Beating a champion like that. His weapon is yours. I hope you will wield it with pride. The sleuth. Come back whenever you want, mercenaries. We have achieved the sleuth. Which is... 32 decks of bestial shot. Deal 40 to 80 dexterity to the target. All allied animals next to target execute an attack for opportunity against them. Let the... Wait, is it level 8? Yes, are you level 8? You're not. Not even my captain's level 8. But fantastic. I, I don't know why my gut feeling was this is level 8, but it is. What do you sell? The Swamp Flask. Okay. Your human companions gain 5% more experience in battle. Oh. Uh, this is good for my Kimi, Diana, and Leheti. Yes, thank you. And uh, let me sell my junk real quick. I can actually just sell this here, it looks like. Uh, but I don't want to. I want to sell in town so I can get more goods. So we can cascade our glory. You know how it is. I need to remember not to sell the pendulum. That's kind of important. Now, I could break this down. How are we doing on repair kits? We have 39. We're fine. Someone mentioned that I can break down, like, helmets and whatnot. Uh, to get their affixes. Which seems like a pretty good thing for me. What am I doing? Torches. How are you doing? Two hits left. Fair enough. Alright. Let's head to the Gerusa clan. Now what I wanted to do was I wanted to hit all of these on our way back to the Gerusa clan. But we're gonna have a change of heart. No, we're not. Why am I going so fast? No, we're gonna we're gonna do this ourselves. Yes. Maybe we'll wait on um, the rat infestation because this is kind of spooky. I don't want to start things off with a tryptophobia, you know. Yeah, it's too late. Let's do it. So, originally I. <laughs> Originally, the goal was to do all these quests along the way and then go back to the city and be like, oh, look, we did all the quests, turn it all in, and sell all the stuff. Crap. But then I was like, wait a minute. If I'm going to do a trade run and get level 8 gear on my way there, or along the way, I can just do all of that and more. Um, then I realized... I can just do all this first, because I'm the best. Okay, I think, believe it or not, Ripley's, believe it or not, the wolves will be pretty good at taking out the outgrowths. Now, because I can restore these, I'm not 100% like, sold on the need to go get them. You know? Also, Hammy will be replaced today. Or maybe not today, but soon. So I want you to be as central as possible and preferably hit all the wolves. Preferably. There you go. Just make sure. Fantastic. We are doing this for the safety and the glory of my new empire. So as just a refresher course for myself and many others, this is a rat infestation. And it is here that we are going to grab a lot of alchemical reagents. If I can do the thing. Wouldn't it be great if I could charge through all that? 
But I can also end this as soon as I want. All I have to do is kill the Broodmother right here. We kill the Broodmother. It's GG. Oh, I want to back up. So, there is like a, a balance you want to walk between go killing the Plague Out Gross for, for fat loot and not taking all the damage in the world. No? So, typically, the way I like to do this is I like to get the Broodmother low, and then once I've determined we're taking too much damage, I can abort instantly. Time for Acorn. Do it. And what I could do, even, if we wanted... You don't move, probably. She does not. Is a barrage. Oh, you lived at six. A foul demon. Born from the bleakest womb. Alright. Time for the wolves to start having fun. Sure, this isn't a great thing for them to chew on, but... Hey, they're Norse. They're not all gods, but, you know. Mythical beings of Norse mythos. I'm sure they'll be fine. The real kicker, though, is that a lot of these start, like, there are rats that spawn near them. So, it's uncanny. I think as far as, like, characters are concerned, Kami is my... Seconds? Possibly third greatest single target damage dealer. Ooh, your positioning's not good, is it? There is nothing over there, okay. First is, of course, Apathia. Also, Lewin can do quite a lot of single target. So we can probably leave this to him. Or not. Next turn. Have all the wolves moved? I think they have. Where's Urson? Oh, there's one down here. Of course, Apathy is our greatest DPS. She always has been. And she always will be. Do I get a point for that? I do! Nice. Now, you may say to yourself, Hey. Oh my god, are you too fat to get there? <sighs> Babe, your barrage was not particularly useful. To which I would say, Oh, young summer child. I love that bonk sound. Worry not. You will see the greatness. Now, there is a, a little concern that I have with some of these characters. Um, need more AP. And that is that when poison is applied to these silly little rats, they heal. It's regeneration to them. Thankfully, there aren't too many characters that are poisonous, but um, there are a few. Well, I guess the Dark Steed can tie this up and pretend he's doing something. I have a replacement planned for uh, Emmy already. I don't know when we're going to find one, though. We haven't seen one yet, but it's okay. 
All in due time. Almost. All right, Leheti. Show me your work. Okay. Wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. I am very interested in getting here with the other boat, though, that we got. Galvanize! You know what that means. It means to my... It means vengeance. It means wrath. Okay, so it's only Maleficar and Hammy that haven't gone yet. Is it even worth doing that? No, I don't think it is. Well done, Hammy. You are brave. You are bold. Get the fuck out of there. All right, Maleficar. There you go. Mm. Oh, it procced. We got, we got to see the proc. The uh, percentage-based damage. Nice. Here it comes. I believe the Brother doesn't move. What now? Do you think my barrage is useful now? Okay. Uh, that's dead. Cool. Let's uh, clean up what we can here. We definitely want to wrath this one so we can get in here. Can I get farther in here? I think that was worse. Yeah, it was. We do not want to hit the brood mother. We are taking damage? Yes. We're not ready yet. Am I tactical ordering this? I hope I can reach Salvaris. I cannot. I could. Okay. Here's a question. If my captain is orderly when he uses... Or orderly. I'm more curious now. When he uses this, do I double... <laughs> Great. Fantastic. Sure. Let's uh, save our Capitan. Not really what I want to use this on, but do it. Then we'll want to stand in the way of our Capitan. Yes, come for Diana. So we have two of the... Oh, we need to leave. Wait a minute. You didn't take more damage from this. You dick. 92 sacks of bloodshed, but you're not bleeding. Why? What's wrong, bro? Excuse me. Okay. Oh, I should have uh, first aided Fenrir. It's okay. Ooh, I was afraid of this. Uh, I can fix that, though. I can fix this less. This is less of a fixable thing. Remember, Hathi and Skull can heal themselves by licking their wounds if they need to. Uh, not the same for Fenrir, of course. Think I'm close enough? And once again, I applied the fragility after my wolves had attack. That's okay. Cammy's here to win. A big fan of Cammy. 
I have like mixed initial feelings on this new class, but I feel like it's such a powerful single target brawler that I'm kind of okay with it. I'd like to get another one, honestly. Can someone do something about this? So Laethi could pierce these guys, but like I said, the most important... Oh, wait, 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 don't do this. You can, you can pierce all this. And it's bleeding, so... I don't know how useful that'll be, but... Well, if I stood next to the Dark Steed when I did the brutal the throw, I would have had brutality. That would have been cool. That would have been pretty neat. Okay, Maleficar. Truth be told, Maleficar is not overly helpful. And remember to watch out for uh, the falling ceiling. Maleficar's job is going to be to... Well, I suppose you can come to this. Okay. Please, I'm in range. No! Okay. It's fine. We're at three. There we go. I was going to use... Maleficar is good for two things in this encounter. One. Murking the Broodmother when it's time. Two. Doing heinous things to these little thingies. And three. Empowering my companions. Now, Urson. I'm using my Valor like crazy, but... Ederson can go help out here as well. We have all three gross in our in our in our eyes. They're locked in. I have to go help the dark steed here. Oh, okay, we're not. Six acts of fever is getting a little high. A little high. Is there someone who hasn't a pet who hasn't gone yet? Now remember, the corrosion from this is going to heal the brood mother a little bit. I'm so glad that didn't kill. Did I say corrosion? I meant the um... corruption. The poison. I got it right eventually. Hey, Red Sonia, would you like to use all my AP? Of course you would. That just means I need to use people who can get it back. All right, Lehti. Help us can reach. Oh, that's not even gonna be a kill. There we go. Gotta be honest, I'm not even sure why that killed though. Not sure why that died either. <laughs> Life is full of mysteries. Who hasn't gone yet? It's more than just Hammy. Right? Right? Ah, yes. Diana, the Dark Steed, and Hammy. I mean, sure. Smack. Good turn. I'm gonna stand here. There's a world where killing this is the wrong play. Because I don't believe these guys can fit in there. Which means I shouldn't have done anything. Oh. I'm galvanized again. I think I lose my galvanization every time they summon adds. Because it's based on the number of remaining enemies, right? 
Bump. Couldn't even kill that. Couldn't even kill that. See? Told you. This guy had to come in for um, Diana. And he's got to go for Herdia. Possibly the correct play? I mean, Diana is already pretty heavily fevered, so maybe it wasn't the right play. But, hey, it was a play. Once again, I think it is the correct call. For us to focus on. Hmm. I'd like to deal with all this. I think this is a, a decent shout. To clear out as much as pot. Is four literally my limit? Feels like it. I feel like if I was going to start clearing these guys out, I shouldn't be clearing out the ones that are uh, in the barrage, you know? But that could have been a misplay. It's okay, we'll reinforce them. Alright, Raycor, good job. Ready? Doing great. How's this situation? Two of our wolves are free. Fenrir is a little wounded. Remember, Fenrir does not have the self-heal. Hmm. I think I can pretty much kill this right away. They do take bonus damage from torches. Yeah. Torches are good. So now we have to decide if we feel like our damage is too great. Are we taking too much damage over here, specifically? Or can we go for a 6 out of 6? Until like Malefic Car being tied up. Like he was doing much, though. I definitely want to get Skrull in the way. Skull, Skrull. I right, want to pronounce that. Make sure he's closer to the rats. Looks like Fenrir's about to get bunked. Now Fenrir heals by killing things. So... He also heals when Lehethi takes her turn. I think it will do. Can I get a triple? Wait, does it work this way? Oh, baby, a triple. Sure. Oh, darn. I don't think this will work, but let's try it. <laughs> it does. Okay. That's cool. So basically what happened there is Fenrir has the talent where he he will heal whenever he kills something. Um, but I thought it had to be like an attack. Like this this attack, the ferocious bite. But it turns out it doesn't. Which adds quite a lot of synergy between him and uh, Beastmastering. That's cool. I like that. I still think that could this possibly be a kill? I don't think so. It was. Okay. It was a kill, but unfortunately, that was my last AP. Ah, I needed to I made a mistake. I need to earn AP. Can I? I might be able to inspiration my way over there. Who can give me AP? 
Lewin, Sovereus. Uh, uh, sure. There's AP. So now we're going to use the bear. I hope person can make it. Oh, he's so close. So this means if I want to get a 6 out of 6, I have to go a full round. I don't think that's impossible. But it's certainly not pretty. We can wait here. Now, Lithigar can tank this. He doesn't have too many sacks of fever. Only two. I need to clean up this. And I think the only way I'm cleaning this up is with Red Sonia. She only has a single stack of fever. Double kill. Galvanize. Go here. Okay. Uh, Diana needs to chill. In fact, I wonder if I can. Hmm. Babe can get me an AP. It's not going to be a good AP, but Fabe can do it. I guess Fabe can. Okay. Why was there a knockout option for a fucking rat? Can I get rats? Why would I want rats? <gasps> okay. This happened a little too late. I guess I can... No, we're fine. What I was going to do was with Fade freeing him and getting a point, I was going to bring him over here. Oh, I cannot afford to kill you right now. Uh, I was going to break Magnus over there and get that attack. This should allow me to leave. Perfect. Now I'm going to go stand next to Rekor. Encourage my barbarian queen. Lewin... Can't really do anything. You can stand over here, I suppose. I don't like Lewin's weapon. I don't. I don't think it's a good weapon. <gasps> Fenrir. Can someone save a Fenrir? I don't think so. But as long as there's not another animal over there, or. Another rat. Fenrir does have willpower. That wasn't enough to kill him. Oh my god, he lives at one. And that's the real one, which means he has a willpower one uh, in the pocket as well. I'm going to have to use a lot of recovery after this. No, here comes the will... Oh. 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 Okay. All right, Cammy. Bring us home. There's a lot of poison you're about to take down. Let's go. Six out of six. Great bait, mate. Six out of six. That's not how that joke goes. And with that, my friends.
the barbarian queen brings us home. Oh, that was tough. The brood mother is dead. That is all six completed. And we got 13 plague ridden samples. We will full heal. Boom. Clean five different rat invasions. And El Capitan is level eight. Well done, El Capitan. Willbauer? <laughs> Applies furry, furry? fury to the targeted animal. So I have a sh I can shoot him with a, the opposite of a tranquilizing dart. Each round, the first attack executed at a distance of more than eight grants two rage. At the start of the battle, gain one allied animal passive skill. Because I have so many animals. That's these. If I could guarantee one of these, that'd be pretty funny. Wait, aren't these actually kind of sort of good? If I get a wolf or a bear... That's incredible. But if I get a boar or a war pony, it's... Yeah, I think we'll save that for Leite and just let Leite YOLO it because, you know, appropriate. So I'm going to go thrill the hunt. Well done. And that means El Capitan can wield Sleuth. Is this better for you? Currently using Avenger. I do really like this bow. It's so good. It's 10 more dexterity. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, Leti, I'll keep your bow warm. Can I have sickness oil on it? Do I I thought I had a backup sickness oil. I did! Wow, okay. <laughs> uh Diana is wounded with a plague. Thankfully, I do have one. We got that from Alizar. And we have a flawed, flawed remedy for Fenrir. Beautiful. There was suspense, drama, glory. It worked out. Now there is one downside. That was quite the encounter, and it took all of my points to deal with it. I don't really want to fight this... How the hell do I get over here? Ah, this ghost pack. So I'm going to run through this, and if I don't encounter them, I don't encounter them. We're good. As the kids say, all is good in the hood. Do they still say that? An old editor in mine. It's one skull. Are we feeling confident? Of course we're feeling confident. What kind of fucking question is that? Wow. Alright. Now, I do have one prisoner still with me. Uh, which is not really what I intended. But this prisoner also is serving as plus one AP, so... It's fine. It looks like we have them kind of cornered, and one of these corners is a lot better for a certain someone. I'm sure I don't have to tell you which certain someone. Because I'm sure you know. So. We're going to have El Capitan start things off with a beautiful galvanize. Come here with... Oh, right, you have this now. So we don't actually want El Capitan to go quickly. Huh. But uh, we're going to hold the center. And we're going to let uh, let the queen do her thing. Got all these points just for her. Have I ever hit three people with this that weren't rats? I don't know. 
I don't think we're going to... Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. There we go. There we go. Now the real question is, what do I want to hit here? I think it's probably best if I hit as many... veterans as possible. So I think if I go here, I can hit both archers and, yep, both veterans. Swing! Bada 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 swing! Goodbye. I'm just gonna go stand over here now. Actually, I'm gonna go stand over here so that you can't get straight on the head. Boom. Bonk. Ah, you went on to her. A choice. A choice, I will admit. There is still one poacher. I think Red Sonia can hit both of these assholes, indeed. And then she can come here and uh, bop, bop, bop. Doesn't it sound like that? Bop, bop, bop. Okay. And go there, kill that, and then she can't move, but that's okay. Okay, fair enough. Now, if I were a Sovereign, where would I be? Lost in the back, of course. Apatia. Hmm. Camille. Hmm. Okay. That's fine. We'll take this gang. In a fight, right? I am being poisoned. I don't quite enjoy that, but... Hey. Shank me, I dare you. Alrighty. Let's see if I can open the way for more characters. Such as Maleficar. Nice, Ursun and Luenker like Maleficar. That's quite strange. I mean, I didn't expect Luen, a servant of the. God damn it. A servant of the lady. The lady. To appreciate a, a herald of the dark gods. I misclicked. Never punished. No, oh, whatever. He poisoned. I suppose Fenrir can go tank this. He just got over his grievous wound, but that's okay. And now, because he's tanking that for Apathia, she... I can throw this. Huh. Okay. I mean, I guess that's why it uses the throwing animation, but I was just like, I guess it just borrows the animation. I didn't actually think anything of that. I don't know why. It just crossed my mind that maybe it was a throwing attack. Ooh, Fenrir. Okay, well, let's get out of the way. Uh, now that I can really do much about that. I am going to... Let's see... Secure a kill. I meant to hit this guy as well. But that's okay. Good galvanize. Unfortunately. It might be worse that I do this. If only I could aim over there. 
Because if Fenrir hits again, he is, of course... Whoops. Going to get more poison on him. So. We don't want that. One poison's enough poison, you know? And that's enough for me. Cammy's okay, gonna stay out of the way. I like how they're both facing the wall. Like, they know what they did. They're in timeout. Alright. They'll just run. I don't like the fact that the game is lagging. Hathi. Go join your sibling. Lewin, can you make this swing? I am in mild disbelief, but okay. <laughs> Fair enough. You do you. And of course, Lewin can patch the wounds of King Magnus. Emperor Magnus. Let's go, Fabe. Oh, yeah. Alright. Well, I think I'll deal with this first. Because I can. And it's a two for one. What's more likely that's going to stop the next turn? Getting a two for one or just killing one person? That's right. A two for one. And they brick. Let's spare Fenrir some more damage showing. Pernicious engagement. The target is engaged in another combat this round. Fragility is applied. Oh, hey, that's what they were using against me in the arena. The arena. Is Fenrir wounded again? I don't think so. He's not, but he did level up to level 8. Fenrir, my boy. Do I need more crit? I don't think I do. 56, that's a good, that's a good number. I think what we're going to do is we're... Excuse me. There we go. Double strength. I was thinking about this after the last episode. And I do think crit hit is probably a better investment. But I do think... There comes a point... Where we, we have enough crit. Like, what's the difference... Between 56% crit and 58% crit? Two. Two is the correct answer. But, like, as a chance of things happening. So I think what I'm going to do instead is go Strength. Just to get an increase to raw damage. And it increases the critical damage of the attack. If your troop is attacked during a rest, it is immune to surprise. Oh, wait. Wasn't this, um... Yeah, Fenrir caught up. So I'm going to give Fenrir a guard wolf. Emperor Magnus. Level 8. Uh, I'm down for double movement, yeah. At level 8, our protector. As long as the unit has no armor, they have brutality. That's unlikely to occur. Apply disarm. Oh. Immune to burning, bleeding, and poison. Yep. Okay. Maleficar, our herald. Of the dark gods up this movement. Those, that's pathetic numbers. Vision ends their turn while not engaged in combat. They gain fury. That works out well because we try not to be engaged. Damage increased by 5% for each bonus applied to this unit. Not bad. Apply to this unit and the targeted ally as many fervor as they have debuffs. Huh. As we get later into the game, I think this is going to be better. But I do really like preparedness. Prepared to worship the dark gods at all moments. Oh, we're inside the mine. This was a quest. For us. It's kind of weird having to use all my characters. And it makes me realize how weak some of them are. How weak they have become. The Jedi are weak. Okay, fair enough. 
We got an ornate key, the Crookstone Mace, which we already have, a whetstone, and some gold. Not great, but not bad. My Guardsman Sovereign, ex-Guardsman, this is lore. I have been informed that there is a special Swordsman class that we unlock, just like we did with the Assassin for Apatia. And I'm torn right now between who I give that to. Because on the one hand, Magnus, my emperor, uh, has been a stalwart protector. But if we're all being honest with ourselves, as I always try to be, he hasn't done a whole lot. <laughs> I mean, he, sta he stands there and makes sure that I don't get punched to death. And his huge AoE buff is very helpful. But I can't help but wonder if he would be more helpful as a secret class. And he's one of the OG, you know? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's half the size of my team. <laughs> oh, this friggin' Where are they? I don't know. Well, where is Raycor? Raycorn, Raycorn, if you'd be so kind, how the fuck, here we go, do I get in here, what a glorious hit. Swing them down to the depths of the hells. Break their spirit and soul. <laughs> Sorry, that kind of just got out of control. <laughs> My face is actually really red right now. <clears throat> I hope you enjoyed the spontaneous singing. I just got really excited when I saw that there were all the veterans in here. I was like, hmm. Yeah, I think you're dead. I also should have moved Sovereus over here, but there's someone else for this, I think. No? Nah, she's over here. Well, let's get Urson in here and see if there's anyone in this cloud. There is not, as I suspected. So we're going to have to deal with this. Um, I wouldn't call Diana a good choice to deal with this. Oh. Oh, that was fast. Wow, a hoppy got... Crumps. Um, I don't think the damage... Well, actually... Sure. Wow, that was percentage-based... That 23, I think, is percentage-based damage. Alright, hurry up. How about Cammy? Get Cammy involved. Cammy wants to win, and I want her to win. The enemy, please. I could have killed them. That's fine. I don't actually know what the difference huh. is. For all this cloak must come from a magnificent beast and is more than adequate for a master trapper. I think I want that on Fabe. Oops, are you? Poor Hathi. My wolves are getting domed. The wolves aren't really meant to tank. My my humble opinion of what the wolves are meant to do is they're meant to. Okay, you have at least more people. The wolves, in my opinion, are meant to come in 
from behind, kind of like a rogue. Once people have lost their armor, so that they guarantee crits and like bleeding and stuff. Okay. I don't think I'm going to need Cammy over here. You know why? Because I'm bringing a certain barbarian queen over. How do I want to do this? Probably dash through here. I'm going to need people over here. Okay. Got it. Let's go. Or do I got it? That is unfortunate. So my goal here is to hit these three, but I think I'm in that position again where I can't. Yeah. Can I hit these three? It's undesirable, but if I can make it happen, I will. Ooh, maybe not. Yikes. Well. If I can only hit these two, I still will. Alright. Why? Okay. <laughs> like, why are we still here? Just to suffer. Alright, Magnus. Not Magnus. Um, Apathia. I guess we're going with uh, Faye Baru. Okay. I didn't think it would come to this. Why is Magnus not counting? There we go. But since it has... Unfortunately... Nice. I don't have any bestial mechanics. Don't do we No. But now that I've set that up, I guess I've guaranteed at least something going on over there. Who are we hitting? Any meany. Don't kill Fenrir. Uh, yeah. Good shot. Uh, that's kind of pushing it for self versus AOE, but still got it. And see, that's another. I didn't ever finish the thought about changing glasses, but I feel like Sovereigns. Get the job done. You know? And I feel like that is not the case for Le Emperor. I mean, he technically does, but... Well done, Kami. I wonder... If someone knows this, I'd love to know. But uh, the new class, of course, is new. Is there a legendary weapon for the new class outside? I imagine that if there is one, it'd be in Belirion, the the new zone. You're Galvanus. Oh. Reading text is important. Not that I would know. Good bunk. Good shot. He's even, uh... Ow? Leave me alone. Okay. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stand here. Okay. 
that's the plan. Do I? There we go. Do I have any damage at all? Of course I do. Not that he's going to come save Fenrir. His father. I think that's how that works anyway. I don't think the genders of the of Hathi and Skull are ever actually divulged. People just kind of assume they're dudes. Brothers. I think. Don't quote me on that. Oh, that was with consuming the poison. Ooh, can I line this up? Wait, 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 wait. Well, there we go. The enemy flee. It took some damage there, but the corporal's plate armor. Uh, could be okay for. Raycore, maybe? Alright, there's no quest over here. Um, but I'm down to explore the wilderness. Which in that wilderness requires a piton! Everyone place your bets. Will I forget to equip the bog, the bog thunder? When it is time to attack mosquitoes. Will I forget? There are a lot of pitons going on here. What am I pitoning to? What great treasure is hidden in the path of the piton? There's a camp. Is this a secret? Un secreto? I don't see anything. Wait a minute. Oh. You know, it's already really hard to get screenshots of the game when I have my bag and my companion slot open. And now we have this stupid Pendulum of the Ancients. Oh, I can't move the camera. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. What was this? I think it's just a stupid tree. Why did I come down here? Is there literally nothing down here? Oh. Un secreto. I told you. A drop-off site for smugglers. Not a great secreto, but it's a secreto. Typically, these give me, like, knowledge. That's okay. I have seven knowledge. What should we spend our knowledge on? There's not, like, great options right now. I don't think, anyway. Well, that was, uh, fun. It's over here. Over here in the middle of fucking nowhere. Not much. Okay. Uh, we have one more quest to do before we return back to... Our beautiful city. By which I mean... Oh, I was supposed to take a prisoner in that bandit camp, wasn't I? My ads, then. By the wonderful city, I, of course, mean the Garusa clan. Where there can be merchantry done. Conducted. Wait, what was the point of this? To avoid conflict with Edoran, the clans have put a bounty on their head. I thought you fucking hated Edoran. No mercenaries. Do you think you're the first ones the Legion sent after us? No. We've killed wretches like you in all of the provinces and counties on this blasted continent. Good a challenge. But we won't give up. If necessary, we'll go to the end of the world to find our one true colonel. And when we come back, Alexa Grathen will make the general shake in his boots. 
about that. Alexa Grathen is dead. In fact, I'm pretty sure I have her weapon somewhere. I don't recall what it was. Interesting that I can do this without a fight, but why? Oh, that's why. They're level 9. Uh, can I do this? My challenge for the day is already done, but I suppose so. I don't remember if I actually made a quick save mechanic. All right, we got this. Wait a minute. Why is that grayed out? It is not grayed out. All right, here we go. Level nine. We got this. We can do this. You know what that means? The greater the challenge, the greater the rewards. All we got to do... Every time a unit ends their turn next to an ally, they gain deflection. Units have protection and brutality when their team is outnumbered. Like right now. Okay, cool. Here's the plan. It's a great plan. A marvelous plan. A wondrous plan. We're leaving. Yes. No, we're not. I'm not a craven dog. This looks more AoEable. So what we'll do is we'll bring the majority of characters over here on the right. And make sure that Fabe can get a really good Galvanize. Which, of course, he can't. All of the wolves are over here. Okay, that's gracious. We want the wolves to come clean it up. We don't want the wolves to be the initiator. I haven't left this side too barren, have I? I hope not. Okay. As we always do, we start with Rancor. As we always do when we have AP. We start with Raycor. Oh my goodness gracious. You guys have a lot of health. We do not want the sappers to do things. Fantastic. I'm going to stand back here. Who are the units that had the bullshit going on with them? I don't think they're here. This unit... This is not the unit's first attack for this turn. Huh. Okay. I don't think I can get any more than three. So we get a Galvanize. I'll shoot this Duelists. I'd love to shoot the Snapper, but we'll go with this. And we will Barrage there. I think it's only fair Magnus gets a really big encouragement. And stands in the way. No, 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 no. Oh. That is not what I thought a sapper would do at all. Huh. Oh, okay. That kind of hurt. I believe it's emissaries that have um, the attack I like. A beautiful swing. 
Wow, that was good too. But won't you die to poison? You will, yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's, um... I suppose we'll get Urson going here. And we'll just attack. I wanted to do uh, Fragility, but... Oh... You guys can't be tied up. Okay, fair enough. Is I think fair enough. That was not a lot of damage. Okay. Is that Fenrir? It is Skull, okay. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here and tie up this Legionnaire with Lewin. Which is not going to be great, but it will get Apatia, give Apatia an opening. And because this, Legion, this Emissary hasn't moved yet, I am going to move in with Kami. Even though she cannot tie him up. Ooh, bleeding. They bleed when their armor breaks? Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Okay. Not great. The hell is confused. No, can't receive bonuses. Yeah, that's fine. It's not, you know, it's not, I'm not crazy about it. I do hope this guy doesn't go straight for about the end. It would be foolish if he didn't, but, you know, I can dream, right? Okay. Ooh, okay. Foolish. Vulnerability. Trying to think of how I get uh, AP here. And I found it. Well done, Malefico. I think we want to get the wolves away. Oh. If you could move just a little bit farther. I'm going to see if I can bait this guy into attacking the Dark Steed. Yeah, I saw that coming. Should have waited. Ow. I saw it coming, but it was still really fucking bad. <laughs> I... Better just made that worse. I don't think he's gone yet. I have nothing to help here. And I'm pretty sure he hasn't gone yet, which means Anke is about to get bonked again. Well, my goal is to get rid of Hame eventually. Now, this is actually something that has changed uh, throughout the development of the game. But a lot of the achievements for like, are things that you need wolf. Or like, so, for example, the achievement where we needed a boar named Hammy. Once. Aww. Oh, this asshole. Well. Uh, once upon a time, it needed to be a boar. A basic boar. It couldn't be a, a matriarch, or, matriarch or whatever. Or the other type of boar that we're about to meet. It had to be a boar named Hammy. And for the 
Alphas. Is it even worth doing this? I don't think it is. That is. See? Told you. Um. You don't. For the wolf thing where... Okay, that's better. Is it? Nope. Not really. Where did that come from? For the wolf thing where it's like, if you have three wolves in your party, the wolves will gain crit chance. That used to apply only to wolves, so it wouldn't apply to alphas, which is why I had some suspicions upon my... On recruiting Fenrir and whatnots. I was really counting. On that doing something. So. Right up at the end. Clean this up. I'm counting on you. Uh, that does lose, lose me the point, but we are getting ever closer to glory. Now we bring in Diana to tie this up. Okay, great. Oh, I'm so glad I did that in that order. Holy shit. Okay, now I just have to kill him. No big deal. Do that. I can... I can do that. I can totally do that. I want to surround this guy with um, animals. It's like the dark steed needs to get the fuck out. In fact, he can tie him up, I guess. Uh, Hemi needs to go away. So Hemi will attack him and then leave. Then Fenrir goes in. That's fine. Then Hati goes in. Uh Okay. That's, that happened. That's fine. Now, Leheti uses attack, which kills with Hati, not Fenrir. Annoying, but not the end of the world. Very careful here. Okay, now we've healed all of our beasts. Now I need to deal with this. Um, yes, we flee. That was so much damage. A legion bow. I hate shoot order. Oh, we did it. Did I see a red over there, Flash. Can I pit on this? I'm not going down, but oh, I can. If there's ever a world where I need to, like, piton up to escape that mosquito pit, I did great. Here's the stone quartz. I suppose you have a quest. We found this man. No idea. Which man? Disappeared. Curses. We never should have relied on foreign. Wow. Yeah, the 
So that was the first quest we had in this zone for the scenario. And basically... Wrap it on this. Uh, there was this Alazarian soldier. Nice. Uh, that was in here. And the... The scholar from Alazar. Where did my stamina bar go? Okay. Didn't want or wanted me to rescue him and bring him back. My humble wares, my good of course, sir. as any proper Alazarian scholar, they left out an important detail. Oh, he worked it out. Why are you so fast? Why are you so fast? Why are you so fast? Ha ha! <laughs> right, they left out the important detail. That's fine. Kill me. You won't find any plague remedies in this. Your wounds have been dressed. Kill. I'm hoping I can say or not repair my armor until I get to a blacksmith. Ted. Listen, Ted. You're gonna have to move faster, okay? I hope war ponies get good. Ted is not a war pony. Ted is one of my carrying ponies. That needs only constitution. Good job. Might she be looking for work? Oh. Role as emissaries is to ensure that all service requests. Hold on. Let, let me let me let me do something real quick. Greetings, merchants. Is it you? These yes. pelts are so pristine that Gosenberg traders are willing to fight plague-ridden horde. Twenty-eight, fifty-eight. You're not from Edoran, right? Nope. We fought those vermin for 30 years. Just uh, looking for... I don't sell croc swine meat. It tastes... Stuff. So we are at 28... Where'd my money go? We are at 28, 18 gold before I turn this in. Might she be the now, Here is your reward. we are at 4,800 and... 52 gold. I will accept the quest for this, um, but I don't think we're ready to fight the the master of the zone. The champion that is celebrates our glory in the arena by singing the song of Britonia. So our next goal, uh, we're going to take a trade run back home. Or back to Marheim. But I think I can build the trade posts here. I just can't build roads yet. Soon, though. Soon. Actually, isn't it 1500 to build this? Hold on, let, let's check. Let's check. We got an anatomy manual. Wow, we must have had a biologist in the crew. In the, the crowd. When I was young, all you have to do is buy the land. Fifteen hundred. Don't worry, I know what I'm doing. This. Ba 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 ba. Mercenaries, I have great news for you. Yes. Oh, I can do this. I just don't have enough influence. Of course. Not like I use it for everything. Okay, let's take this. These pelts are so pristine that Gosenberg traders are willing to fight plague-ridden hordes and swamp creatures to buy them. I think we... Oh, no, I can't remember. We can do everything except for spices, right? I think so. Possibly. I'm going to pick up the grease. Just in case. Because there is a reason. I would like it to do the tomb. Oh, no. Okay, we're going to save our stamina here. And we're going to take a run for it, I think. We're not. Cool. What the hell is that aggro radius? Thank you. Holy shit, that was so close. Restore my armor, please. Now that's a job well. 
Okay. Oh, while I'm here, being locked in by mosquitoes. In isn't always easy, but it's our clan's way. The El I can sing the song of Bretonia again. Might she be looking for work? I mean, that is an easy way to get, um... Inform Marheim. Yeah, man. Living in the swamp Wait, did you say I was easy. saving influence? Because I just spent... How much did I just spend? Hundred and thirty one? Oh no. I was trying to make some cheap money off of that. That's okay. Because we can just sing the song of Bretonia everywhere we go, and our influence will skyrocket by the grace of Zileidi. We are of course her greatest champions, most chivalrous, honorable, and selfless. I haven't sided with the local rulers or anything in almost every situation. Actually, have I? Technically not. You know what? Let's give it a shot. We're going to put on the SWAT. Okay, they left the moment I decided to do so. I take it back. Um... I would have sided with them in every situation, if it would have allowed me to. Whoa. Okay. The only time I haven't is with Vernalis. Vernalis was technically an upstart. It was Lahart. Who was the rightful ruler of the realm. Where's the jail over here? Why are you all so far away? Get you on my way back. You know why this guy hasn't run yet? We put him in his tent. A tent. And I believe he's at Diana for company. Or Cammy. But you know, both of them make pretty good company. Don't believe me? Just Google Rule 34 Cammy. Or Diana. Don't do that. Don't actually do that. Actually, you know, you can. Just, I advise you to be above 18. For legal reasons, I must advise you to be above 18. <laughs> uh, the internet. What's it good for? There was like a meme song. It was like, the internet was made for porn. Which... Not inaccurate, honestly. I haven't really been helping these merchants. They're just, they're on their own. Red bandits. Eh. You know what else is red? My stamina bar. Good job. Good job, me. Now, I need to make sure I keep... Ooh, hello. That's a gold merchant. Um... I keep some money to upgrade my legendary weapons. Stand back, peasants. These valuable commodities are only for those who can afford them. I will cut you. Don't test me. Shellfish. Where do those come from? All righty. Let's go to the forge and see what we need. To make this glorious level 8 death. This also means it's probably time for weapons, right? Yep. Journeyman, 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 journeyman. Uh, maybe I can make these as well. How many knowledge points do I have left? Oh look, I have three left. What a coinky dink. Let's see. Is this armor... Level 9. It is. Well done. Alrighty. So we need... Oh, I need cloth for this. Is that because it's light? Please be because it's light. Oh, I need cloth for this. Is it because it's leather or medium? Oh, I need cloth for this. Okay, so it's rhyme steel. How about these weapons? What do we got? 
Although, so at level 8, we have El Capitan, Rekor, Apathia, Magnus, Maleficar. Okay, so we want to check out what the, the sword and the polearm is. Oh. The damage is good. Don't don't get it twisted. But I really like the multi attack on uh, Maleficar's current weapon. Big fan, tremendous fan. So what is the sword? Ish, I'll take sh Ash Ward for five hundred. Just a basic attack. Not a priority. Basically, is what I'm getting from this. So I think we are prioritizing here. Oh, I used all my points. We want to prioritize armor, basically. Is the short and long of it. I don't want to make a training dummy. Okay, so I need cloth. Uh, we need one. Use light, right, fam? Yeah. Light, medium. Light, medium, light, heavy, medium. Two mediums, two lights, one heavy. I hope. I have enough for this. First, let's see what it takes to make rhyme steel. It takes gray clusters and alizarian powder. Okay. Damage of the poison is increased by 5%. That might be really good. I don't know if that's what I should use a poison brain for, but I got some good knowledge from it. Okay. I got lots of cloth. I love it. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Where's my alizarian powder? Ooh, okay. Did not expect that alizarian powder would be what was holding me back. Fair enough. Just enough, though. A master alchemist. Lehti. Can learn recipes and brew master concoctions. What do we got? You're not Lehti. Oh. Just can learn master stuff. And has 10 decks. Not bad. So that means it's about time that we start putting... It's all so confusing to me. Cammy on the table? If we wish to keep her as Dex. Which, you know... Not bad. Or excuse me, if we wish to keep her as an Alchemist for the Dex. I mean, it's either that or... Uh, could go Tinker? Could go Angler. That wouldn't be awful. Thief? Would also be pretty good. I think I respect the full decks. For, uh, Cammy. After all, you have to be quite flexible to move those thighs. Just thinking about it. Makes me happy. Alright, so. We need... Let's focus on... How much coal do I have in the bank? We want to focus on our, our people who are being punched a lot. And because Magnus is already a thick boy, uh, we'll focus on the others. Which means double medium and light. I just know this year will be a breeze. It's hmm. a lot of coal. I can make coal. So, armor. If I were to, like... Okay, I can't. I was going to say, if I were to try and make 
the, like, you know, increased... Whoa, that was fucking fast. The quantity. How would that work? But you can't do that. Fair enough. But right, I'm ready for you, bitch. Wait, you didn't do it that time. You didn't do a fast thing this time. Did I just get cloth back? Well, that's good, because I'm using it for this. Also, whatever Fabe was wearing... Ah. <sighs> Uh, whatever Fabe was wearing looked exactly like this. It shares the same model. Which is fine. This is different. It's about to look like Captain Fabe. I suppose I could wear that tracker here. If I wanted to keep things different. Rhyme Steel Breastplate for Le Emperor Magnus. The pious emperor of the Imperium. Boom. Okay, now... I'm going to want this too. This looks so cool. Uh, I want to see the layers. These look so cool. Their art's so good. So I have... Four Colossal Paws. Where do these come from again? Are these from Nightmares? Oh, I guess that is a reason to farm them. Kind of annoying. Huh. That's a lot of crit when you think about it. I wonder if this would be better to give to Raycor. Instead of this one. Like, I can give one of these to her, right? I think I'm going to do it. These are all the Colossal Paws I have, by the way. I imagine I'll get more. I don't want to put this in uh, Pathia's armor. We'll give this to Raycor. Now, we have a fun little quirk. How are we doing on weapons? Can I make any of these? Swords. Wow, I have a lot of Rhyme Steel. Okay. I was afraid that I wouldn't be able to do this. The thing is with the hats, I don't find the hats to be too particularly... Too particularly good, you know? I like the... The affixes from the hats we find. Like, for example, Magnus's hats has the venomous coating, which has been funny. It's critical damage stat, whatever. And then we have Assassin's Strychnine, which just seems incredible. This is okay. Like, Raycor is using this. So, I don't know. Anywho, I have a fun little quirk. Thanks to my mastery of the dark arts. Yes. Where we can remove the layers and not destroy them. Light. Light. Did I make... <sighs> I made triple light waistcoats. Of course I didn't. I just know this... I had a call for that. I think I had enough call for this. Bah humbug. Well, I love a car. It's pr this is probably better to be honest. 
if I remove these. Sorry, Maleficar. I made you, uh... Light gear, but you can forgive me, right? Right? You can totally forgive me. He won't mind. We can take these out. Equip this. I'll take one of these armor. Or excuse me, movements. I should take both of them. Screw you. They're mine. They belong to the Emperor. Then you can take one of these. Crit hit decks, so I love it. Ba da ba ba ba! Rakor can take both of the good things and this. Look at her. Doesn't look like a barbarian at all now. Now, there we go. How to correct that. There you go. Hopefully, I can make her a one that has three slots. Mmm, look at those stats. Now, Fabe has been wearing this for a long time, but I think it's time that Captain Fabe gets some, uh, some armor on himself, you know? And I can actually make slots for these. If I could. So the benefit to a Trapper's Cloak is I'd have plus one range. And I would look very different. But I like the elegant look we've got going on here, you know? We're playing Fashion Souls. I don't know why you're surprised. I'm always playing Fashion Souls. Can I make any uh, layers for you? I'm gonna have to Google where I get more Colossal Paws. Crit and Dex. Yeah, okay. I have a third one, right? A third slot. Okay. El Capitan. Nope. I believe it only costs me repair kits to... Hello? Pull out these uh, layers. Perfect. Wait, this one. Cool. Look how much gear I have. Letty. Can you wear this? You can. Congratulations, Letty. So we will unequip these. This. I had another one. There we go. Perfect. Look at our little beast master. I really miss using my knockback bow. I suppose. I suppose Lady could use it for now. That way I don't have to upgrade this. I haven't minded the Indomitable bow. Could use a credit if the target and an ally are engaged to each other. Ooh. No, 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 no. I like this. Because we can use this to knock back stuff. Okay. Now that we have done a bunch of uh, that, which you have been here with me graciously. Thank you. <laughs> Is there anyone that can use this while I'm here? I don't think so. Nope. Wait. Haha. -ha. There you go. Uh, graciously, thank you all for being here, enjoying the inventory management, an important part of this game, I assure you. Well, this part seems like... less important. <laughs> I don't think it would hurt if I did this off-camera. But you're here with me anyway, and I appreciate that. 
keep in the grease. That could go there. Wait a minute. I am low on flawed remedies. What do I need for that? One of these flowers. We go here. I think it's time we start leveling up Cammy. It's all so confusing to me. Buy all those. Let's choose Cammy. I appreciate that it tells me what I can and cannot make. I mean, I might as well make medicine, right? Holy shit. <laughs> wow. Okay. I... I'm I'm a big fan of this uh, bonus experience thing. Yep, big fan. Already, Cammy just jumped immediately to Journeyman. Her plus seven dex. It's all so confusing to me. Wow. Who would do this to my family, and why? I don't know, bro. <laughs> That's that's something you're gonna have to ask yours. What? Yourself. It's all so confusing to me. Who would do this to my family and why? Oh right. Yeah, I was like, wait a minute. I haven't done a trade here yet. I went straight to the forge. Well, the trade empire can't this have that. This has been screaming his head off for days. I am this close to making him eat his cart. You already full refresh, don't oh, shit. Thanks. And I will take that cloth. Thank you uh, very much. I'm concerned about the vineyard disease. Are you? Because I'm going to sing for the song, the people of Britonia. The song of Britonia. How much of this could have been done off camera? I don't know. You can tell me, though, because as we celebrate the Song of Bretonia, we wind down this glorious day of progress. And what progress have we made? We're almost all level 8, and our initial OG characters who, let's be honest, are carrying this team, are all well-geared, well-defended, well-equipped to take on the challenges of the Ludern. Tome. Before we head back, we will, of course, have to continue the trade empire and upgrade our level 8 weapons so that Raycor can keep on Raycoring next time. Thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. Thank you to the patrons and the channel members who support the channel. I greatly appreciate you. If you'd like to stay up to the channel, feel free to join the description down below, and I will see you next time. Bye.